Jesus is the vine. No, not a short-lived social network for six-second looping videos. A literal vine, and not just some random growth that you want to cut and burn, but a grapevine. In John chapter 15, Jesus explains the metaphor. He says, I am the vine, you are the branches. My father is the vine dresser. Then he says that some abide in him and are pruned so that they might bear more fruit. The word abide means to remain, to stay. So many commands in scripture are to go, to talk, to speak, to believe, to act. This one's easy. Stay here. Remain here. Abide here. Stay in Jesus. Stay in the vine. Then Jesus says, because apart from me, you can do nothing. Apart from Jesus, apart from the vine, you can do nothing. You can't fix a problem. You can't stop a sin pattern. You can't change your feelings. You can't quit an addiction. You can't forgive your parents for getting divorced. You can't overcome your feelings of insecurity and shame about your lost virginity. You can't stop looking at pornography. You can't let go of your crippling addiction to people's opinions of you. You can't stop gossiping. You can't run away from your fears. You can't stop your fears. You can't defeat your fears. You can't accomplish your goals. You can't get into the college you've dreamed about for a few years. You can't make the team. You can't get the girl. You can't win. You can't succeed spiritually. You can't read your Bible every day. You can't pray with success. You can't see prayers answered. You can't lead someone to Christ. You can't share your faith successfully. You can't do anything without Jesus because you're a branch and he's the vine. Apart from him, you are nothing and can do nothing. That's why the command is so wonderful. Abide in him. Remain in him. Stay with Jesus because he is the vine. And that is an awesome thing about God. Do you believe it?